Certain employees considered essential during the pandemic are asking why they're not eligible for the vaccine until everyone is in May. Madeline O'Neill brings us the answer from the state and joins us with a plea from manufacturers. Well, the CDC actually put manufacturing workers in phase 1B, the phase we're in now. So when they didn't make the cut for that, they hoped they would be a part of phase 1C, but that's not the case. At Teal Plastics in Baraboo, the workers keep essential products rolling off the line. Making COVID test swabs literally every day, 24 hours a day since March 5th of last year. Now the vaccine rollout. It's a little surprising has manufacturers throughout the state feeling left out. We aren't anywhere really on the list, and especially with some of the work that we're doing, it would be, I think, really impactful. Wisconsin Department of Health Services guidelines have manufacturers and some other essential workers getting the vaccine at the same time as the general public in phase two. Manufacturing workers have to be a part of that equation. Wisconsin Manufacturers and Commerce is asking the state to reconsider. They have been a part of the response to COVID-19 and they've been deemed essential, but now when it comes to getting the vaccine, Governor Evers and DHS have said they're not essential uh, and simply they're not going to be prioritized. According to DHS, the state's about 500,000 manufacturing workers weren't included in phase 1B because at the time supply was too limited. Given where we're at with vaccine supply. Now with a lot more doses, 1C will include an estimated 2 million people with high risk conditions, but not specific jobs. Continuing to create eligibility by occupational group is confusing to everyone. And and um, we are going to get there very soon. And many, many of those employees are now eligible uh, because of the chronic health conditions. That's not everyone working at places like Teal Plastics. We're taking the best precautions we can. Where they're still waiting in line. It's just not the same level of safety as being able to get everyone vaccinated would be. The CDC has listed other work groups in its recommendations for phase 1C, including housing con construction, media and information technology. Many who won't be included in 1C here in the state and will wait until phase two with the general public, which should start by May 1st.